International Airport. Terminal C through F will be the last four stops on this train. TSA pre-check is available in terminals A, C, D, E, and F. Note that passenger screening at terminal C is for TSA pre-check passengers only. The wheelchair accessible stations are Terminals A East and A West, for Airport Departures, Air Lincus, American Airlines International and Caribbean Service, Charters, British Airways, Iceland Air, Lufthansa, and Qatar Airways. Terminal B, for Airport Departures, American Airlines Domestic Service, Terminal C and D for Airport Departures, American Airlines Domestic Service, Air Canada, Alaska Airlines, Delta Airlines, Spirit Airlines, and United Airlines. Terminal C and F for Airport Departures, Frontier Airlines, JetBlue Airways, Southwest Airlines, and American Eagle. Okay, we're riding a new Scepter Regional Rail Line on the airport line leaving Philadelphia Airport bound for 30th Street Station. Philadelphia is the first city in the United States served directly by a commuter railroad. You could say Mark serves BWI, but the station is not on the airport property. This station is right in the middle of the airport. This stop, Airport Terminal B. Watch the gap when exiting. Stop airport terminals A East and A West. Watch the gap when exiting. The SEPTA Regional Rail Line was open to the airport in 1985. This is the airport line, making all stops to Center City, Philadelphia, except Terminal A.
in, I got my preferred seat on this train, the second row. Second row behind the window. Usually you have to sit in the third row as the second row is roped off, but not this one. Approaching Eastwick Station. This is the only intermediate stop on the airport line. This stop, Eastwick. Watch your step when exiting. We join up with the Northeast Corridor at Phil Interlocking, and we take it on into Arsenal Interlocking and Penn Medicine Station, and then on into 30th Street. It's a beautiful day in Philadelphia today, about 77 degrees. Very un-October-like. Well, that's the way this month has been. Constant tension catenary here. You'll notice the weights hanging from the catenary poles. They're adjustable depending on temperature.
approach medium here. I think this is Sixth Street's junction interlocking. I'm about to enter the northeast corridor to head toward the city. Truss Bridge we're approaching, that's the old B&O into the Philadelphia, now CSX, part of their main line along the East Coast. And this is Phil interlocking where we join up with the Northeast Corridor. and the track that's coming down the slope on the left-hand side. That's the SEPTA Regional Rail Line to Elwyn Media, Elwyn. For the end of the year, it's going to be extended to Wawa. That's the uh, old Westchester branch of the Pennsylvania Railroad. going up on the right is the West Philadelphia Elevator Branch. And that tower you see dead ahead on the right a little bit, that's the old Arsenal Tower. Thank you. 
watch the gap when exiting. Have your key cards or passes ready to tap or swipe at the turnstiles to exit the station. This is Penn Medicine Station, used to be called University Station. station. This is a wheelchair accessible station. For connections to set to regional rail, market Frankfurt line, and track and New Jersey transit. Yeah, sorry if the window's a little smudged, but in the light it doesn't look too bad. You might notice it in the tunnel before we get into 30th Street. Watch the gap when exiting. Have your key cards or passes ready to tap or swipe at the turnstiles to exit the station. That's one of the nice things about having my senior key card. I can tap in and out anytime I want, anywhere I want. Other than going to New Jersey, the ride is absolutely free. Now you know why I like to go to Philadelphia so much.